Today's topic is syphilis. Syphilis is a sexually transmitted bacterial infection, usually spread by sexual contact. After initial infection, the syphilis bacteria can remain dormant in the body for decades if not treated. It can then become active again. If left untreated, syphilis can severely damage the heart, brain, and other organs, and even be life-threatening. In 2015, about 45.4 million people were infected with syphilis, leading to about 107,000 deaths. About 60% of new cases in the United States occur in men who have sexual activity with men. Causes Syphilis is caused by bacteria called Treponema pallidum. The most common mode of transmission is through sexual contact with an infected person. It can also be transmitted from a mother to her fetus, resulting in congenital syphilis. The bacteria enter the body through compromised skin, such as through minor cuts or abrasions in the skin. It is thus transmissible through direct contact with an active lesion during kissing. It is impossible to contract syphilis through toilet seats, hot tubs, or sharing eating utensils or clothing. This is because the bacteria cannot survive outside the human body, making transmission by objects extremely difficult. There is an increased risk of acquiring syphilis if you engage in unprotected sex, you have sex with multiple partners, you are a man who has sex with men, you are infected with HIV. Symptoms The symptoms are characterized by four stages with varied symptoms associated with each stage, primary, secondary, latent, and tertiary. The primary stage presents with a firm, painless, small and highly infectious sore called chancre. The sore appears at the spot where the bacteria enters the body and usually develops three weeks after exposure. Some people develop only one chancre, other people develop several of them. Many people with syphilis don't notice the chancre because it is usually painless and may be hidden within the vagina and rectum. Chancre resolves on its own within three to six weeks, but if left untreated, the disease may progress to the next stage. The secondary stage presents with a non-itchy rash that begins on the trunk and eventually spreads to the entire body, including the palms of the hands and soles of the feet. This stage may also be accompanied by hair loss, muscle aches, a fever, sore throat, and swollen lymph nodes. These symptoms can resolve a few weeks after they appear or repeatedly come and go for as long as a year. The latent stage can last for years, during which the body will harbor the disease without symptoms. After this, the tertiary stage may develop. About 15 to 30 percent of people with syphilis who don't get treatment will develop complications known as tertiary syphilis. In this stage, the disease may damage the organs, including the brain, nerves, eyes, liver, bones, heart, and joints. Diagnosis and Treatment the disease can be diagnosed by testing samples of blood, which can confirm the presence of antibodies that the body produces to fight infection, and cerebral spinal fluid if nervous system complications are present. Treatment Syphilis is curable if diagnosed and treated in its early stages. Penicillin is the preferred treatment at all stages. Penicillin is an antibiotic medication that can kill the organism that causes syphilis. If you have been affected for less than a year, a single injection of penicillin can stop the disease from progressing. If you have had syphilis for longer, additional doses may be needed. After you have been treated for syphilis, the doctor may ask for further treatment follow-up, which may include periodic blood tests and exams to make sure you are responding to treatment, avoiding sexual contact until the treatment is completed, and blood tests indicate the infection has been cured. Be tested for HIV. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.